Hi guys, welcome back to Daniel's Tech World on YouTube, also putting up these videos on LinkedIn. And I wanna to talk today about something uh, useful if you are doing video marketing across different social platforms and uh, specifically how you can use Canva in order to work with a video shot in your conventional horizontal video format, which is a 16 to nine aspect ratio and try to find ways to present that in ways that are mobile optimized. So for mobile optimized video, we're looking really at two common aspect ratios. One is the one-to-one -one aspect ratio. One-to-one -one is obviously a square, it's a box. And the second one is nine to 16. So we're taking the classic 16 to nine horizontal aspect ratio, for instance, in HD video, which is 1920 by 1080 pixels, and we're going to invert that to get 1080 pixels across and 1920 down. So if you take out your phone and you look at what way the phone is laid out, you're gonna see that it's in portrait mode by default and a video in that uh, proportions is going to look the best if you're scrolling through a, a social feed. So one way you can do it, of course, is to shoot your videos in uh, 16 to nine in the first place or in one to one, that's definitely something you can do. Or what I'm trying to get across in this video is how you can rework your horizontal video uh, in order to make it look better vertical. So there's two ways really I'm gonna show you guys that this can be done in Canva. One is going to involve kind of stretching and it's gonna create kind of a bit of a zoom effect. The second one we can do is we can just add a background or some other graphical element in the background and uh, put your horizontal video on top of that. We're gonna see uh, how that looks and without further ado, uh, let me jump into Canva and I'll show you guys how you can how we can do both of these things using this to put out mobile optimized video for distribution on networks such as Instagram, Facebook, Reddit, Twitter, or really any platform where you can expect the majority of people clicking into your video are going to be doing so on uh, mobile devices. Okay, so I'm just in my Canva workspace now. And what I'm going to do is create firstly a one-to-one -one video. So I'm gonna go on create design and I'm going to type in here a uh, Facebook video. And that's going to call up a template that's gonna be in the one-to-one -one aspect ratio. So Facebook video, 1080 pixels by 1080 pixels. Now what I'm going to do, I just took 10 seconds out of the video I'm currently recording. And I'm gonna just drag and drop that into Canva here. And you see, we're going to put that here. So I'll just pause my video and I'm gonna just take off the sound so that doesn't come across into my video. Now, the first thing that we can do, you can see this is a classic uh, 16 to nine horizontal video. And I'm just gonna show how the two things I did are going to work out. Firstly, you can just stretch in Canva. Now this admittedly, you can see does not look the best. I'm very kind of uh, stretched up, but it does get the job done. If that's something you think, you know, it doesn't look too ridiculous, a real close up on your face. Uh, I don't really think that looks great. Uh, the second thing that you can do is actually just kind of crop into the video a little bit, all using Canva, and you can just get rid of those sides. And again, you're gonna kind of get the cropped in effect here, but it might just look um, a little bit uh, a little bit better. Finally, um, I'm gonna just undo those changes and we're gonna go back to the initial horizontal video. And what I mentioned earlier is that you can try to just kind of design around the video a little bit by putting a graphic element in the background maybe cropping a bit here. I probably wouldn't have my uh, name title here. And this is beginning to look, you know, a little bit more acceptable, I would say, in terms of closeness. And uh, you can just do a little bit of resizing. And of course, you could put a title to the video here, such as, you know, uh, my thoughts on Canva. And that's the beauty about Canva is that you can integrate all these different elements into one thing and then just push this down a little bit and now we can just play the video and look at look at how that looks. And it's beginning to look a bit more normal and we're now in one-to-one. -one. So then you can just click on share, download, and uh, go for the default option of MP4 video. And it's gonna take a little bit of time because Canva needs to integrate all these elements into the video file it's rendering, uh, but you'll download your video format uh, resized as one-to-one. -one. I can also, of course, repeat the process by going for uh, video in the other aspect ratio. So I'm going to do a 1080 by 1920 pixel uh, canvas here, and this is what it's going to look like. So this is, as you can see, the kind of uh, classic shape of a mobile phone display. So it's you know it's basically going to be the same process in terms of editing this video.
I'm just going to pause this here and you can again play around with it in order to attempt to resize this video. I could take this much of the video and have graphical elements uh, below it as it is in the last one. And again, it's going to be a similar process of clicking download and clicking MP4 video and this will allow you to pull it out. You could have a title here, social links here or whatever you want. And of course, the real trick would be to record something like a wide angle uh, so that it doesn't really look too overly cropped when it uh, goes into your face. Hope that was useful. Thank you for watching and subscribe for more videos.